Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Reno, Nevada with a frauder that goes by the name of Sacramento Community Watch. And in this video, he uh, meets up with the wrong officer and spews off all the usual frauder stuff such as uh, obstruction as a physical act and things like that. And well, it doesn't hold over too well with the officer and he ends up getting arrested. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining the Sacramento Community Watch. We are in the city of Reno, Nevada, right off of West 2nd Street and North Virginia Street. Uh, looks like we have Reno PD, multiple vehicles. Yeah, that's right. Uh, several police vehicles, yeah. And you're going to go over there and spew out all the famous frauditor lines, and one of them will not hold over well. And you're going to find out the hard way with a shiny new pair of bracelets here in a very short period of time. Of course, we're going to walk up and see what's going on. So it looks like we have five vehicles so far as what I see. Right here at the Nevada, Cal Neva Nevada Hotel. First vehicle on the scene, 171. 210371. Vehicle's gonna be occupied one. Hello, how's it going, Gaudier? Pretty good, man. What's going on out here? It's gonna be uh, additional vehicle 072 200272. It's gonna also be occupied one time. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, what's going on out here? Nothing. Nothing? Excuse me? Step away from your vehicle. Okay, this is our vehicle actually. The city's vehicle, okay? This is our vehicle. Uh, no, it, it doesn't work like that. You don't have any ownership over this vehicle whatsoever because ownership implies that you have the ability to make decisions on what you do with that particular piece of property, which you don't have the ability to sell it to anybody. So it doesn't belong to you at all. Now, it doesn't really belong to the officer either, but he has uh, leased to use it by the city itself who owns it. And the city can decide whether or not they want to sell this vehicle or anything they want to do with it. So, yeah, you don't have any ownership over it at all. So quit acting like you do. So that's one famous uh, frauditor line down. But wait, there's more. Hang on to your seat, baby, because this one's a screamer. Also, when you're dealing with public, I'm recording for my safety as well as yours. This is Officer Hoyt with the Reno PD. How are you doing? Is there something I can help you with? No. You jumped out your vehicle. Yeah. I mean, I didn't... Why are you interfering with our investigation? Interfering? Yeah. That's a physical thing. I'm walking... Hey, frauditor. Well, smooth brain frauditor. Interfering is not an entirely physical act, dude. Let me just give you a little scenario. Should I... Should you be driving along the side of the road in the middle of heavy traffic and I, uh blow an air horn off on the sidewalk and you happen to look my at my general direction and uh, rear end a uh, vehicle in front of you i just essentially interfered with you driving which caused you to get into an accident the same thing applies to uh police officers and in, in, in during an investigation if you cause them to be distracted by you at a scene like a shooting or anything like that and they end up getting hurt 
Well, you just interfered with the whole thing by sticking your nose where it doesn't freaking belong. So, really, dude, you need to think these things out because they're so much more complex than you think they are. On a public sidewalk, recording you during the course of your duties. What are you talking about? What are you place your hands behind your back? Okay. And well, there you have it, dude. This ended fairly quickly. The officer didn't waste any time because this dude has been watching way too many frauditor videos and thinking that he could do exactly what they could do and get away with it. Nope, doesn't work every single time. And in this particular scenario, he ended up meeting the wrong one. So at any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.